great morning everyone hi I'm Christy okay so today is Friday and today we're going to do a nice combination of a little yoga Tai Chi and Pilates and some really good breath work so I want us to really warm up that connective tissue um, and I want you to visualize like a really cold block of butter and we're going to introduce some movement to melt the butter. So I want you to think of all of your connective tissue, maybe as a little rigid right now, and we're going to warm it up, all right? So all you need is a mat, if you have one. If you don't, just a towel is fine. A little water, maybe um, a towel, uh, if you, you know, sweat a little bit, because you probably will. And, you know, a big smile and a great attitude, a lot of heart. And let me know what you think after the class. Your comments are super valuable to me, so please keep them coming so I know what to give you more of, what to give you less of. Um, it, you know, help me with the queuing if you need a little bit more instruction here or there or not so much. So your comments are super valuable. So are your um, approval ratings. I appreciate those. And please tell your friends about my YouTube. Appreciate it. All right, so let's go get those items and meet me right back here. Okay, so let's get started. We're gonna start by really warming up the spine and the back. And I want you to do this. I'm gonna turn sideways. Let me take my jacket off. I should have done that before I started. Um, but we're gonna round through the spine just like this. And I want you to feel that connective tissue gently lengthen and then we're gonna look up. Just like that, okay? Starting out super easy. Now I want you to add some breath work here, okay? Round, exhale, inhale, open up. Exhale, round, inhale, look up. Couple more. Inhale. And let's go for one more, okay? And inhale. And pull the shoulders back. Now I just want you just to gently wrap and tap around the body. Let those arms go. Just let them go. Again, think of, visualize that melted butter. We're melting the butter, warming up the fascia, all that connective tissue that helps support our skeleton structure. We're gonna work all the way from the top of the head all the way down to the toes today. Different body parts, just lengthening them. Now let's focus on some really good breath work. Breath in, breath out, tuck the chin to chest. Inhale, exhale. Breath in, breath out, breath in, breath out, again inhale, and exhale. Now come center, rub those hands together, we're going to do a little open and close here, open and close. Now when you do this, use that breath. Inhale, exhale. Again, inhale, exhale. One more please. And exhale. Now, warming up the cervical spine, the neck. I want you to take the gaze over the right shoulder. Come center, left shoulder. Come center, right, come center, left, come center, right, and finish it up on the other side. At your range of motion, release down, circle the shoulders back. All right, now deep breath, inhale, here we go, big smile, inhale, exhale. So, I don't know if any of you are feeling a little anxious. Exhale. 
but I want you to use this breathing technique anytime you're feeling anxious. It's easy to do with all the uncertainty. So in with all the good positive thoughts and exhale. And one more, here we go. Breath in and breath out. And right back to that open and close. Rub those palms together. Here we go, open and close. Open and close. Breath in and breath out. Now we're gonna open up through the spine, creating length in the spine. So bring one palm towards the floor and one palm towards the ceiling. Lengthening through that spine. How about growing a few inches here too, right? Getting a little taller each time. All the way up. All the way up. Good. Complete it. Now we're going to introduce a little bit of spiraling. So get this energy ball, turn it on its side. I want you to spiral to the right and come center and spiral left and spiral right. I'm going to turn the music up just a little bit because we have our garbage collectors coming around. <laughs> spiral right, come center, flip the ball, spiral left and spiral right. Good. Left. Warming up all the muscles that stabilize and support that spine. All right, now palms down, Now we're gonna go into some weight shifting. Here we go. Tap, 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 good. Now, can you make it just a little bigger and lift? Now, here's where we're gonna build some heat, okay? Again. Nice weight shift, keep going. Give me another full set. Right here. Reach. And we have four, three, two. Now remember how we were warming up the spine. We're going to do that again. Take it around, pull back. Again, around, pull back. Breath in, breath out, again. And bring the hands mid-thigh, lengthen through the spine, round through the spine. Lengthen and round, good. Lengthen through the spine, round. One more, roll it all the way back, now the weight shift. Up. Reach. Lift. Now you can take this tap to an extension if you want to keep your balance and focus on that balance work. Give you another set right here. Here we go. Up. So the movements are expansive. They're big other movement that we do in the other types of classes to lengthen those muscles. Here we go. Around, pull back. Again, around, pull back. Again, big movements. I'm giving you hugs every time I reach around, by the way. Big hug and pull you into me and give you a big hug. Hands mid-thigh. Here we go. Flat back and round. Again, flat, round. Do it again. Flat, and round, flat. And we're going to roll it all the way up, guys. We got another set. Here we go. Reach, and sweep, and change. Lifting from the core, all the way up. Little bobble there, but that's okay, 
right? Wobbles and bobbles are wonderful. Give me another set right here. Woo! Can you feel that heat generating in the core? And lift. One more each side. Ah! And come center. Bring it down. Here we go. I'm getting ready to hug you. Big hug. Here we go. Take it around. Around. Pull it in. Hug again. I have two more hugs in me. Around. Pull it in. And around. Pull it in. Alright. Hands mid thigh. Flat back right here. We're going to round through the spine. Press flat. And round. And press. Good. Round. Press. One more. Roll it up. Sweep tap. Here we go. Up. Or sweep and lift. You pick it. One more each side. And how about a big hug to finish this one off? Ah, uh, hugs. I'm gonna pull you all into me. Hug yourself. All right, reach around. All right, so now I'm gonna turn the music down just a little bit because the garbage truck is on. So, <laughs> grab some water if you need it. So now we're gonna go into a balance track, all right? I want you to do your best with this. Uh, if you need a chair nearby, go ahead and grab one, or you can just hang on to the wall. You can come by the, the wall and just hang out there. I, I tell you what, I'm going to turn side so you can see it. I'm your mirror image, so I want you to go ahead, get your balance on the right foot first. So let's, let me start forward, and then I'll turn. And then we're going to pick this left knee up. Now, we're going to cross over the midline of the body, a little tap and then out to the side. I want you to reach up overhead and keep your chest open and lifted here, okay? Out to the side, good. Four. Three. Two. Now reach up, all the way up, hold, 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 and bring it down. Gently circle the hips all the way around, north, south, east, and west, and reverse it. Good. Now bring the arms up again, this time other side, right? So right knee comes up, and here we go. Cross the midline of the body, up, and tap side. Good. Focusing on that balance and that core strength. Show me your heart. Give me a big smile. Doing great. Hang on to that balance. Hang on to that work. We got four more team right here. Stay committed. And here we go. Three. Good. Two, and one more. Now hold it right here. Up, up, up. Hold, 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 and bring it down. Circle those hips around, all the way around. And reverse. All right, staying right with that balance, we're gonna alternate a little bit here. I want you to balance on the right, and I want you to lift up with the left leg and punch right. Opposite arm, opposite leg. I want you to channel your inner karate kid here. Bring it down. Remember, wobbles are wonderful. Yeah? Wobbles are wonderful. You're doing great. You're doing fabulous. 
stay with this balance work. It is worth it, I promise you. I promise, promise, promise. All right, we're gonna do two more each side, okay? Opposite arm, opposite leg. down, circle those hips around, and reverse. Alright, sink down. I want you to push up, balance on the right, open up into star. Chin up, head up. Hold, hold, for eight, seven, six, five, four, higher, three, two, and one. Bring it down and switch. Hold. Hold. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it down. Hip circles around. I heard a sound. I don't know what that was. <laughs> kind of startled me. And reverse. Okay, so now we've warmed up. We've done some balance work. Now we're gonna go into the challenge track, which really heats up that lower body, all right? So I want you to go into a plie squat right here. Now, I want you to open up through the chest. We're gonna take our fingers and we're gonna touch the floor. I want you to keep your chest open and then we're gonna rise up, okay? So sink down and then lift. Now if you can't touch the floor, that's okay. No worries. But if you can, I want you to get those legs nice and deep. Sink into those legs, those large muscle groups. Stay with me here. A little touch and lift. We're going to do four more just like that, okay? Our challenge track means it's a challenge. So big, big muscle work. Give me two more right here, please. And one more. You're doing fabulous. All right, now I want you to stay low in the legs right here. Give me, we're gonna give high fives to each other, ready? High five, push pull. So I want you to feel the muscles work in the legs. Feel the muscles work in the core, wrapping into the back. And then feel the heart work as we give each other high fives. Each time we bring that hand forward. Oh, sink lower. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Ah, come on, front to back. Front to back. Here's four. And three. And two. And one. Now, I want you to stay low on the plie lunge, focusing on balance, working the inner thigh and the calf. Alternate the calf lift. Heel up. Say a little prayer. Heel. Heel. Keep going. Up. Oh. We're going to be sore tomorrow. A little sore, right? Come on, we got four more each side. Heel. Heel. Let me know if you like this music. This is yoga fit music. Best shawl. One of my first instructors with yoga. Love her. She's amazing. All right, now, little touch down. Here we go. Touch and lift. Woo, touch. Lift. Come on, drop it into those hips, guys. Open up those hips. Keep those knees soft when you come up. Keep going. We have four more. Here's three. Keep going. Here's two. And one. Oh, we're going to stay low. Now, you ready? High five. High five me. Stay low in the legs. Little push pull. Less than two minutes left on this challenge track. Hang 
Hang on, team. Hi. Bye. Me. Good. Front to back. Here's four. Three. Two. And one. Good. Say a little prayer. Sink into the legs. Oh. Heel. Heel. Come on, lift it up with me. One heel. Now the other. Less than a minute. Burn, baby, burn. Heel. Heel. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ah. Ah. Two more each side. Woo! One more each side. Good. And toe heel together. All right, shake it out. Let's get a quick drink of water, then come right back, okay? Okay, so now what we're gonna do, we're gonna work on some exercises that really strengthen and maintain the integrity of the low back. So if you're ready, let's go ahead and go to the floor and, um, I want you to really focus on the glute strength because it's super important to keep your glutes strong, your butt, because when the butt muscles are strong, your low back is strong. And as we get a little older, that might be a little compromise. So I'm going to show you a couple of exercises that you can do uh, and put into your fitness program every single day to help maintain the integrity uh, of your low back. Okay, super, super simple exercises. I'm just gonna show you three of them and um, would love for you to put them in your fitness toolkit, okay? So the first one's gonna be your bridge. And we did this, I, I know we did this the other day, I do this all the time, because this really helps save my low back. So hands right by the glutes. Now you're gonna take that arch out and put the arch in. So this is just a pelvic tilt. But if the bridge is too much, this is a perfect go-to exercise. Now, if you can, I want you to push your hips up and squeeze the glutes together, and then come down. Squeeze up. So you're squeezing your glutes together. I want you to pretend like you got a $100 bill right in between your crack, okay? And you don't wanna lose it, so you're gonna keep those cheeks super tight. Squeeze them together, bring the arms up, for a little more spice to the workout. If it feels better to keep your hands down, then you certainly can do that and press through the palms for a little extra help. Whatever works for you. We're gonna do 10 more and nine and eight. Look at how I'm picking up my toes too. So I'm driving it more through my heels, okay? really lifting up so when you drive it through your heels you're going to isolate the glute not the hamstring okay the glute here we go we got five more four three two and one good job so we're going to bring that down now i'm going to turn over on my side and we're going to go into what we call clamshell so i want you to visualize the clam now there are two body positions. You can come here, but I prefer to come all the way down here. So avoid doing this because then your cervical spine and your back are out of alignment. Now you're gonna pull your knees forward. So there, you've got um, yeah, right at a 45 degree bend in your knees and your knees are in front of your body. Now you're gonna bring your finger pads here and I want you to lift and lower so where I want you to focus is this top glute right here so whichever glute is highest towards the ceiling that's where I want you to feel the work now watch if I push and open my knee too far you're not gonna feel it okay so keep your hips stacked and the movements tiny okay add this extra little lift here I mean this extra resistance here so you can feel the work in the glute now guys ideally you want to do 30 of these 
when you do a set. 30 on each side, all right? So let's give it a go and see if you can feel it. Come on, squeeze up. Oh, yeah, I can feel it. Can you feel it? So when you do these exercises also, I want you to focus on uh, and just notice which side a little weaker than the other, okay? Lift, lower, we're about halfway through this first set. So hang on with me team here. Lift, lower, up, down, up, down. Woo, we got 10 to go. Here we go with 10 and nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, very good. Now, uh, you can just roll over. I am going to come up and switch positions so you can kind of see what's going on. And we're gonna do the same thing to the other side, okay? So get in that position, add that little resistance, lift and lower, think of a clam. Lift and lower, we're gonna do 30 on this side, keep that hip forward. You know, coach your way through these. Just tell yourself every time you're feeling that heat and that muscle groove, your body's getting stronger every single time every single time. We're about halfway. So stay right with that top glute. This is where you're going to feel it right here and you might not even need to add that extra resistance. It's up to you. Here's 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful. All right, so now we're gonna go face down and we're gonna go onto all fours right here. I want you to spread the fingers. Let me tuck my shirt in, because, just because. Okay, all right, hands right here. Hands right up underneath the shoulders. I want you to extend out one leg. Now keep that hip parallel to the floor. We're gonna lead with the heel. Squeezing into the glute. We're gonna do 10 times with the straight leg and then 10 times with the bent leg. If you need to go onto your elbows, that's perfectly fine, okay? Smile. You're on candid camera. That's what I find, feel like anyway. It's like, I'm on candid camera. Two and one. Now, bend. And I want you to pretend like you're putting your footprint on the ceiling. Nine, eight, good, seven, feel it, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, bring it down. Other side, lengthen that leg out, lift, lower, up. Keep that hip down. So, you know, I'm guilty of these little nuances too. So when I cue you, I'm cueing myself. Four, here's three, two, one. Bend that knee, put that footprint on the ceiling. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, keep going, two, and one. Good job, come all the way back. Stretch those arms way overhead. Let's do a big, generous stretch here. You did a fabulous job today. Way to honor your body and work in a different way. I love this class because it's radically different than any of the formats that I'm teaching during our quarantine. And your body needs that stretch. It really, really needs the length in the fascia, in that connective tissue. So please make sure you're doing that. So let's bring one foot in. 
um, into you and extend the leg out so it's like a half straddle position and I want you to take your left hand here I want you to reach overhead with that right arm and come up and I want you to reach for that extended leg with that left arm let's do it again up overhead right arm and reach try to grab those toes if you can if you can't that's okay come up reach last time on this side and switch good and come center let's switch legs all right flex that foot if you can now make sure you can feel your sits bones and if you got to move some junk around like I do then do that all right so overhead with that left arm lengthen through the left side of the body Woo! bring it up and reach and again up with the left over lift reach good and one more side up and reach you're doing amazing 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 come center cross the legs all right inhale arch the back look up exhale oh they picked up tempo with the music inhale look up and exhale well that's fine we can groove we can start our day so right it's friday have fun on Friday, make it count, be fabulous on Friday, be fantastic on Friday, but most importantly, be fit on Friday. Love you guys. Can't wait to see you all again. Thank you so much for participating in our fitness programs today, but please remember before you start any exercise program to consult with your physician first. Please honor your body. Thank you.